But you look so good. Oh, I know, yeah. It brings out the color. Why don't you talk though, about 12 years now you've been here? Oh, gosh. Oh. It, I mean, uh, it, you know, when you start a job at the age of 12, you're still young when 12 years <laughs> late. You know, I wish. Um, no, I think the biggest difference of being here 12 years is I used to relate to them and I'd always say, I'm like an older sister to you. And now it's always like, you and my mom, I, I get related to their mother. I'm very maternal now to, to the team. So I think that's, <laughs> and I'm actually not being very sarcastic with, with that. I feel feel very old. So I'm hitting 40 this year. So let's publicize that to them. When is that? During season. Oh my goodness, October, are we having yeah. a four-year-old birthday party night? No, or I'm, I'm coaching volleyball. We okay. don't do anything for birthdays. No, I met everybody else. We should have that yeah, good I might, I might be in black. Okay. Okay. So. <laughs> Kirsten, talk about being rated in the top 25 for the second year row. Uh, I mean, it really shows this program has arrived and everybody's looking at you. Yeah, you know, I think uh, sometimes you, you want to go under the radar, but I really, I was more excited about it because I thought it was a great uh, showing of respect to the program, especially for us to be unrated at the end of last year to hop into the top 25. Um, is a testament of people doing their homework, the fact that, you know, everyone returns as far as our starting uh, core of kids. And, you know, I think it is a, a great sign of respect. Now, with all that said, it, and it's not coach speak, it doesn't matter where you are at the beginning of the year, you want to you wanna be there in the at the end of the year. Is it um, still a big deal for the kids? Or? It's been a couple of times now where you've been ranked, or is it becoming a habit for me? It was funny. A couple of our seniors, because I, you know, we came in and we said, you know, at some point we said, you guys see that we were in the top 25? And they're like, yeah. And they go, this two seniors said, do you remember how excited we were three years ago when we broke in for the first time? And they were like, it's not a big deal now. And I thought that was a really great sign for the program. So where do they want to be on? Goal, but. Yeah, I don't know if we've set goals as far as where we want to finish ranked. I think goals for the season are, you know, we didn't win the Big East last year. We got second, and we want to we want to win a Big East championship. And then um, we want to obviously make the NCAA tournament. And, and we've been fortunate. We've won around each time we've been in, but we haven't crossed that next, next echelon to the Sweet 16. So that, you know, is really the prize that, we're, that they're all eyeing. And a lot of things play into that. Draw, you know, getting in, all those things. But that's, that's a primary goal for the year. Kristen, talk about this team. You've got six starters back. Is this the best team you, you think you've coached going into the season with the players that you've had coming back? Gosh, I, that's a hard question to answer. I don't know. I think we've got a lot of pieces that are strong. I think we have more depth this year. I can tell you it's been a much tougher challenge this year to determine a lineup. We still are very fluid on deciding a starting lineup. I would say three or four positions literally are still up in the air. Um, so those things, the depth is big. Um, I think we have a lot of potential, but I, I just think, you know, a lot of things happen. Chemistry has to be good. So with that depth, that means that players have to buy into roles. So, you know, are they going to stay on board? You know, and I think we've got a group that understands that, that it has a team before self sort of attitude. Injuries, you know, there's lots of things that are out of your control. But do I think we have pieces to make us great? I do. I do. But now we've got to put it all together.